Shamrock Rovers won, Drogheda United won, and Evan Weir scored an equaliser for Drogs as they battled hard to come away from Tala Stadium with the point. Weir volleyed to the net in the 87th minute, but two minutes later was shown a second yellow card. It did look harsh. Rovers sub Idemo Amaku had given the home side the lead in the 79th minute when he headed home a terrific Sean Cavan across. Rovers had most of the possession, but Drogheda's defence were solid and resolute throughout. Drogs started brightly, but then the home side grew into the game. Any times Rovers did create anything, Drogheda's defence did well. In the 20th minute, Richie Towell shot over, while a minute later, a ball over the top was played to Aaron Green. He appeared to be pushed by Drogs keeper Colin McKay, but no free. Darren Mack, Markey did well to get into the Rovers' box. He put in a cross, but Alan Manis was out to gather. Then in the 34th minute, Colin McCabe got a hand to Graham Burke's shot to push it out for a corner. And five minutes from the break, Dylan Watts should have done better with his effort as he blasted the ball over the bar. Drogheda very nearly took the lead in the 49th minute. Keith Cowan's powerful header was cleared off the line by Burke. It came back to Adam Foley and his header was cleared off the line by Pico Lopez. On the 55th minute, Kavanagh tried his luck and his shot got a deflection out for a corner. Then Gary Deegan's strike in the 74th minute got an important deflection off Kavanagh for a corner. The deadlock was broken in the 79th minute when Amaku scored his first goal of the season. With time running out, Weir drew the visitors level with a stunning strike but two minutes later he was sent off for a second yellow. Amaku could have won the game for Rovers right at the end but Ryan Brennan got a block in to direct the ball out for a corner. It ended at Tallis Stadium. Shamrock Rovers won. Drogheda United won.